them are. Most of them don't even care. But there are people who know about the issues. There are people who know that tax incentives are nothing more than a way for government officials to legally give our tax dollars to multi-billion dollar companies. People who know that corruption happens at every level, from the schools, to the churches, to the nonprofit groups. They're all taking a bite. Then why aren't they doing anything about it? Why aren't they up in arms, fighting them in the streets with their bloody hands? You should know. You're the one who told me. Didn't you, Martin? Aren't you the one who told me that this country is filled with people who would rather watch white water rafting than actually do it themselves? People who would rather watch a game of poker than actually play a hand? People who don't vote in the election but who care more about who the next damn idol of the stars is going to be? This country's filled with watchers, not doers. Isn't that right, Martin? Come on, is that right? That's right, Tommy. You think most people care about the world's good? Most people would rather send underdeveloped countries rice and soy than meat and produce. <laughs> Why not keep the weak and powerless? It's hard to start a cultural or political revolution if you're too weak to even walk to the supply truck. And there's not a supply truck here. We're fat, ignorant, and full, yet no one is taking any action. Why help another country when you can play a video game that does? Not everyone is fat and lazy. This country's filled with people who are crazy about fitness. Well, crazy about fitness because they're crazy about sex. Why else would they be working so hard on their glutes or pumping up their pecs to stay in shape? Come on, Tommy. They're as bad as the video gamers. They just substituted one for the other. They still don't know who the acting ruler of Lebanon is or who the hell Hezbollah is. And do you think they give a damn about saving the environment or stopping global warming? They're not complaining because their cars are getting off too much carbon monoxide. They're complaining because their gas is too damn high. They didn't kill the electric car. Good marketing did. So the whole planet is helpless. Is that it? This country's filled with ignorant, lazy people who don't care that their clothes were made for 39 cents, but that they got them on sale for $25. <laughs> you think that the corporate companies have gotten their marketing propaganda down to such an art that the consuming public is entirely powerless? Is there no hope that anyone will ever wise up? They would rather get high or drunk than actually do something. Well, I can't believe that. I can't believe that the system is entirely broke. By your ruling, this entire country should be destroyed in a fiery holocaust like Sodom and Gomorrah. Wiped clean off the planet. Let's go get the nuclear weapons. I hear Israel has plenty. Hey, if it needs to happen, you can't stand in the way of progress. <laughs> what progress is that? A recession back to the Neanderthals? A complete cleansing of an entire civilization? No chance of reforming a single individual? What can a single individual do? More than you might think.